Hey you guys and welcome back to Life with Ro Nicole. It's Ro here and today I am tackling my master bathroom and also a little bit of laundry. I don't know about you but my laundry has actually probably doubled or tripled since we've been in quarantine. I don't know why because y'all aren't going anywhere. If you are new here, welcome, welcome, welcome. Thank you so much for clicking on this video. I hope you like it and me enough to hit that subscribe button down below. Also, don't forget to turn on that notification bell so you're notified every time I upload a video. If you are an oldie but a goodie, hey girl, thank you so much for subscribing and sticking around. So let's hop right into the video. So I'm going to start by putting all of these clothes in this laundry basket. I have a really bad habit of taking my clothes off and leaving them right here in this corner. And then I put them in the laundry basket at the end of the week. I know y'all, don't judge me. So I'm going to start by spraying Lysol on everything and letting it sit for a minute and then coming back and wiping it all down. So now the cleaning begins. I am going to start with cleaning this window. I don't remember the last time I've actually cleaned it. It's been quite a while. And one of the reasons why is because I'm always struggling with these blinds when I let them up. It is ho so hard to get them back now. You got, you got something on your mind. I'm going to try to help you let it go. So I don't know what I was thinking about, but I cleaned my toilet bowl before I actually cleaned like the outside and around the toilet, which made absolutely no sense because I had nowhere to put the toilet brush. <laughs> So of course I'm cleaning this window and I decide to open it and there are wasp nests and I don't know what those little brown things I think those are wasps like nest too but yeah I, yeah <laughs> this is why I'm like usually scared to open these windows because we don't have screens in them and you have to be careful especially around this time of the year is getting warm and the walls are out i hope everybody is staying safe and healthy physically and mentally i know that for some people being alone and being quarantined has been pretty rough on their um, mental state so i hope you guys are staying busy and learning new things and picking up new hobbies or just you know chilling enjoying yourselves enjoying your families also, I know so many people, including me, who are still going to work and going into the office. So I hope you guys are taking all of those safety precautions seriously, wearing your mask, washing your hands, spraying down everything, y'all. I spray down everything in my office every single day. The doorknobs, I even spray down the doorknob that leads to the hallway into my office. So 
yeah I am very serious about not getting affected and not spreading germs throughout um, my workplace you guys have seen me clean this glass with so many different products I've used Ajax I've used the Dun & Vinegar I've used um, awesome Windex um, just so many different things but I have realized that the thing that I like the most and cleans the best for me is the dryer sheet method and that's just using a dryer sheet that's already been used wet it and just wipe down the glass it works so well it gets the glass really clean and it also helps to repel the water off of the glass when you use it the dryer sheet and the dye and vinegar work the absolute best for me Y'all, my vanity is usually really gross and nasty. Y'all have seen it up close and personal, but these past few weeks I haven't been wearing any makeup because of course I am wearing a mask to work every single day. So it wasn't dirty, like literally hardly at all. You know, just usually the toothpaste residue and things like that, but no makeup and I didn't really have to scrub it. I could have easily just cleaned this with a Lysol wipe, but I'm so used to just spraying it down. But yeah, I miss my makeup, y'all. I think I'm just gonna start putting on some makeup and like walking around the living room or walking around the neighborhood just just to make me feel better. That's all. No, I'll be there wherever you are. Cause you sound bright like you sound bright like a shoeless star. glass cleaner I'm using is from Dollar Tree and honestly it actually works better than Windex I think it's the ammonia that they put in here but I like it way better than Windex back of me and picking up a thousand hairpins along the way I don't know where these hairpins come from y'all I've had braids for like the last month so they're definitely not for me I don't know where they come from like I just find them every time I vacuum how can I compare thee when no one ever ever could come close look around but I can't see that is usually just how it goes Brought a new horizon Opened up our doors to something more Spun me round and you shook me Got me tainted to the core So tell me, tell me, tell me what to do When nothing, nothing, no one ever comes close to you Close to you For the longest time done is on to the laundry so I have had so much more laundry to do I don't know why because all my kids do is go outside ride their bikes play 
walk around the neighborhood maybe and that's it like y'all are not going anywhere so why do y'all have so many clothes i don't understand and it's annoying you can't follow laundry without watching some tv or playing some music and today i was watching all american y'all i love this show it is so good i don't know why it reminds me of like beverly hills 90210 but with black people anyway i really like it and i highly suggest it but i know it's true Some other shows I have really enjoyed on Netflix are What If, which I liked. It was really good. Also, The Stranger is really good. Um, and if you like like fantasy, sci-fi type of shows, Lock and Key is really good as well. If you guys have any suggestions on some shows that I should or or movies I should check out on Netflix, please. Leave them in the comments down below. I think the next show I'm going to check out is Ozark. Um, my cousin told me that one was really good. And also my mom told me Money Heist was really good. Um, so I'm going to check both of those out next. So that is it you guys. I hope you enjoyed the video and I will see you in the next one.